Kelly High School's boys basketball team, we have Martavius Russell, Tyron Smith, and Jemiah Stevens, along with head coach Adrian Scott. How y'all doing, man? Doing good. Good, how about you? Great. Um, we're going to start off with something easy. Um, what is y'all's favorite movie? Say a favorite movie? Uh, get Rich or Die Trying. Blue Chip. Uh, Creed 2. Pursuit of Happiness. I ain't never heard anybody say that. I ain't never heard anybody say that. That's the difference. What's your favorite ice cream? I don't even eat ice cream, to be honest. I don't eat ice cream. <laughs> uh, vanilla. Vanilla also. Cookie and cream. Cookie and cream. I know you eat ice cream. Now, going into, you know, playing basketball, just regular life, you know, music is always something that's part of our life and everything. So, what is y'all favorite type of music or specifically the type of artist that y'all prefer to listen to? My favorite artist would be 42 Doug. Doug. Fire. Fire. For sure. Mine's probably UGK. UGK, fire. Uh, I listen to Rod Wave, but I don't be in my feelings, though. I just listen to Rod Wave. No, I listen to Rod Wave. No. You ain't your feelings, bro. You ain't your feelings. You can be honest with me. You can be honest with me. Uh, I listen to Rod Wave, too. Can't leave it by myself, so you know. But, you know, his music hit, though. Yeah. You know? Uh, probably be more focused, make it back to the final four, make it to the state championship, and win the state championship. Uh, probably just limited turnovers. You know what I'm saying? Compete with each other, get better, and win the state. Our main goal is to win the state. Which, you know, you gotta set little goals before you get to the big goals. So we're gonna move up. Like we're gonna set our goals as we go down the road. Like you said, our main goal at the end of the day is to compete for a state championship. But uh, along the way, we got some other milestones we need to reach. How would y'all describe yourselves as basketball players or as people in general? Mm -hmm. I just want to get the most out of everything I do. I don't like to be, I, it's rare to see me satisfied and I just like to go hard into everything. Uh, I'm very vocal. Uh, I feel like I'm a leader. Uh, I'm just a well-rounded person overall. Probably a real laid back, goofy person. Uh, laid back, but extremely competitive. Why don't you just talk about Coach, the guys you brought today. Why did you choose these guys? Why did you choose to bring them today? Um, I, I chose these three guys. Uh, they've, they've been a staple in our program for the last few years. Um, have allowed us to have some success over the past few years. And uh, three of my hardest workers also. Mm -hmm. And then just maybe talk about the team in general. What are you most excited about this year? What does the season look like? Um, I, I'm excited about uh, new guys uh, having a chance to step up uh, into different roles. Um, I think we have a chance to be uh, extremely good. Uh, like I tell them every day, we, we've got a lot of work still left to do, but I, I think we have a chance to be extremely good this year. What was the biggest challenge? What's the most? What's the biggest thing y'all worked on during the off season? Uh, the biggest thing we worked on during the off season was probably increasing our skill levels, increasing our skill levels. Certain guys who didn't play a lot of minutes throughout the past few years. And guys, for y'all, what are you what are you working on this year? What's the biggest challenge for you? Where are you trying to improve your game? I'm trying to work on my three-point shot and get into the rim more. Uh, I'm just trying to work on like getting better at defense. It's everything for me. All right, what about, um, let's just talk about the Sipsy Valley community a little bit. What does it mean to, first of all, ask the, the boys, what does it mean to have a packed half? What, if you could say something to the community to get them to come to the game, what would you say? I don't know. There's not too much you'll say. Once they hear about the game, they're going to show up. Come and we're going to put on a show. That's what I would say. Well, thank you for the support and just keep coming out and we're going to keep putting on the show. And Coach, for you, what does it mean to 
have the support of the community? Can we get more people there? What do you, what do you need? Uh, it's to extremely do? important. I always feel like we can get more people in the stands. Um, but at the same time, I feel like the community, especially over the last few years, have done, has done a good job supporting us. Now, with that type of support, even through the biggest games, do that help y'all? Like, with the, you know, even like from the biggest games, like rivalries, championship games, do y'all support y'all fans and sense of travel? Do that really? That you feed off that energy? Oh, yeah. Yeah. For sure, for sure. Yeah. Make you play harder. Make you play harder. It'll give me butterflies for the game, but like after I run out and I hear them just, I'll be locked in, I'll be all in. Yeah, I'll be all in. It just, it makes you feel comfortable, like you did, like you said. So, yeah. I said, I love us having the packed house, uh, but more than anything, I'm excited for the players. You know, all the hard work they put in, and they get a chance to be rewarded by seeing the fans out there supporting us. Right. Uh, I was going to ask y'all, uh, any of y'all can answer this, uh, what's it like to have this group back uh, with leaders like these three uh, as seniors? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's definitely great, you know what I'm saying? We got a chance to get to the Final Four last year. That was our first time. We, we had the experience, so I feel like this year we should get forward. We should win state. Like, like we know what it takes, so we just don't, like, show our young guys and demonstrate, like, greatness and teach them how to be leaders. So I feel like, you know what I'm saying, it's going to be easy. Yeah, easy. But as mentors with y'all team, coming in from, like, you know, the new guys that come in, the freshmen, Does that really help y'all a little bit more, like understanding them and then understanding you so the team can get better? Yeah, you be a better leader for sure. How about you? I feel same thing. Same thing. Yeah. Same thing. Now, what about you, Coach? Now, when new people come in, how's that? How do you? I, I think it's um, I think it's definitely great to have uh, a core group of guys back. Uh, show them new kid, new, new guys, kind of how we want to go about things, how we want to do things. Uh, like I said, I, I don't think it's, it's no substitute for having that experience coming back. Right. Well, that's good, and thank y'all very much, and I hope y'all do the best. Thank you, Thank you. Appreciate you.